Hey guys, welcome back to another video. So I'm gonna cut right to the chase and get to the ingredients here. Um, so we're gonna be making a soup. You can even make a stir fry. It's gonna be udon katsu chicken soup. So these are the type of noodles, the udon noodles. Just get these from your local grocery store. They're already cooked, so I'm just gonna throw these into the broth. They look like this in two packets here. You can use any type of chicken broth that you have. This is a bone broth, it's super good for you. Um, I'm gonna be using mushrooms. If you don't like mushrooms, you can either leave these out or substitute it for something else. We have green onions to top it off with. Four chicken breasts. These are already pre-marinated, just with some salt and pepper. One egg, some breadcrumbs, flour, and then this is optional. I grabbed this hot sauce packet from one of these hot chicken ramens. This is the stew type. So it's specifically for soup. Um, I just wanted to add it for some flavor if you like spicy food, but totally optional. If you wanna see how this all comes together, then keep on watching. So first, I wanna start by sauteing the mushrooms just a little bit. I even added some black pepper on them, not too much. And this is how they're supposed to look. They're probably in here for about a minute or so, and I'm gonna to toss it into the bone broth right now. So now I'm gonna be taking each of the chicken breast fillet, and this is kind of the station I set up here. So your egg wash, your all-purpose flour, I mix a little bit of cornstarch in here, and then we're gonna end it with the breadcrumbs, and we're gonna take it over here to the pan and fry everything, so. totally up to you. You can even double coat it if you want it extra crispy, which I think I'm going to do. Right into the pan. And then slowly you want to do tip first and lay it down. We just have it on medium heat. Okay, I'm gonna finish the rest. So now, this is about the time when you're gonna wanna flip it. You can kinda of start to tell, even from the side where it starts to get golden here, you just kinda of flip it. Mmm, that looks fire. And then as that's cooking, because we want it to cook thoroughly inside, um, I did lower the heat a little bit. Um, we do have the rest of our broth cooking over here with the mushrooms. Okay, so after flipping them, they start to look kind of golden brown like this. I'm going to put a top on them for 5 to 10 minutes just so they thoroughly cook on low heat. And then while that's cooking, I am gonna throw the noodles into here. So I'm gonna add the noodles in the broth. I had already added that spicy packet, so you can see it's nice and red now, a little spicy. Um, so you can do a taste test, I already did a taste test. I added a little bit of water um, just to dilute the spice a little bit. I'm gonna add those noodles in. And after these break apart just a little bit, I'm gonna be adding a little bit of sesame oil, just for flavor, probably like just two drops. I really like the toastiness. Okay guys, so this is how it turned out. Just final touches. Grab some green onion and top it off. I actually like a lot of them but add it to your taste. 
Um, let me know if you guys like videos like this, like cooking videos. I know Amy and I haven't really posted anything like this in our channel, so comment down below and let us know what else you'd like to see us cook. Thank you so much for watching, and we'll be back with another video.